our mind is really, really good at filling in the blanks. Visually. So here's what I mean by that. In my very last fight, the one that put me into retirement, I, I had a serious injury. My opponent had these loaded wraps, and with a single punch, he fractured my skull. You might be able to see this, this squishy dent right there. It's, it's a depression fracture, and there was a hairline all the way up here, and it, it uh, did some damage to the eye as well. And after the fight, um, I noticed there was a big black, like fist-sized blind spot in the middle of my vision. And it kind of freaked me out. I was like, oh man, I'm, I'm, I've got a big blind spot. It's just, just this black blind spot in the middle of my vision. And um, it's actually still there. But five years later, it, it's, it's, it's kind of funny because I don't always see it. Because my mind in this time frame fills in the blanks, weirdly. I mean, it is still there. If, if I concentrate, if I think about it, I can see it. I mean, or, or not see it, if you will, because, you know, it's a big black blind spot. I mean, I, I'm, I'm aware of the fact that it's there if I, if I focus on it. Okay, there it is. But, again, the mind is so, so good at filling in the blanks if we let it. So, is this image I'm seeing when I'm not paying attention to that blind spot, is that simply imaginary? Because again, if, if I'm not focusing on that black spot, I, I, now I don't see it at all. Five years ago, I mean, it was like, oh man, just blocking my vision, obscuring everything. So again, our eyes are not cameras, because physically this, this is impaired. Physically, I shouldn't be able to see that. But again, the mind fills in the blanks.